This was a project that I did not think was gonna take this much effort, ingenuity. Like the amount of times we redid and went back to the drawing board from nozzles, the sparking, from using tasers and spark plugs. It's, this was so much more than I could have ever anticipated, but we didn't stop and we finally got it to the point where I think you're gonna be happy. One thing that stayed tried and true this entire system, these are beer tigs and this system worked so well. These beer kegs are filled with gasoline and we have a CO2 tank inside the cab, pressurizing these tanks. And then that gasoline flows through our uh, safety keg adapter, which goes through a solenoid. And this is our safety solenoid. And that runs all the way down to these nozzles that are inside of the exhaust pipes. Now, we have tried a few different nozzles. The first ones were brass. And those ones, again, I showed you earlier, they were melting. We were having a lot of issues getting them to stick. And with a Hail Mary attempt, we went to Home Depot and we found power washer nozzles. Just happened to be all steel, and they also just happened to be the best part for this car. Um, so we finally have a good spray pattern, and we're really, you know, you've seen earlier videos of the flames. We are shooting flames now. And to top it off, these tasers have worked phenomenal. We have tasers that we ran a remote switch. So the button that you would typically press here on the side, I have a remote switch inside the cab to activate it. And these two wire leads run to spark plugs that are inside the exhaust tips. And I'm thrilled. I'm so excited for you to see it. Um, I think we should shoot some flames up. <laughs>